What's up guys, this is the Rifeman on our back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States. And as you can see, the Prussians have slipped just too close to my fortress at Konigsberg. And I'm, I believe I'm going to invite them to attack. So let's get involved and fight on. They do have mortars, so they will be sub fire from my own howitzers. B. Really? They'll move them close enough so I can hit them with um, quick climb shot from my own howitzers. Hopefully. I can't remember if I do or don't. Enemy will try to smash their oh, way I already have a breach. Use your Tasty. Because you know what breaches mean. Prizes. And this also happens to be a deployment zone. Good. So you're all ready. Uh, fortunately, I can't get two sets of guns facing that direction, but I can get them facing like so. Fire will off. Unlimited fire will off. Because the blunderbuss shotgun is inside this building. Blunderbuss shotgun is inside. Well, no, they're going to be. Yeah, they're going to be inside this building too, in case they get close. So I have one free unit of artillery. So heavy horse artillery can go here. It is. Okay, let's put my line infantry on the walls. It's usually well, it's still a good strategy. Even if it's just to plug holes to make sure they don't capture key areas. There's nothing, there's nothing to say they're guaranteed to go for this breach, but it's usually quite a good bet. Okay, let's put you inside this house as well. Cool. and then I'm left with grenadiers to hold the line against the breach. Ooh, en f engineer foot guards. I'll put them there, better than nothing. Then I have this many grenadiers in reserve spread right out in this direction. In case there's enemy quick climb shells. Ooh, another unit of howitzers. You will go here to do exactly what you guys think I'm going to do. Then one extra unit of artillery, which is going to be way back here. General back here. Good. Straight ahead. Okay, so. Terry. We're deploying. We're deploying them too close and kill some my own men. So limber up, pull back. Which so they are going to actually try to assault the walls. Not you, because you're very, very small. You, you grenadier guards, get up there. Whoa. You get down. You position yourself there in a blocking formation. You get yourself in that building. So this should... Straight into the general.
like this. Then before I quick climb on the breach. So you've redeployed, get back. Turn guard mode on. Bringing these infantry down to in reserve. Comes another general's bodyguard. Another general shot to pieces. points you can attack that piece of artillery if you want so I'll bring my ground air guards down here because they're freaking out about manning the wall this unit of line however will man the wall fire onto the mortars please actually I'll put this unit of line infantry down here and this unit of grand air guards stand by to engage in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Time a little bit. There we go. That's what we wanted to see. Not firing the guns, sadly, but still getting involved. Granite guards have grappling hooked, but they won't look like they want to go in the breach. Good, slowly picking off the battery. Are these guys gonna actually fire? Excellent. Guys, back onto firing shrapnel at the breach. Bit of a frame rate drop because the eye can't figure out what to do. Like, I think pretty much sure it's something like 
So I, I asked about this on the Turbo Reddit sub, uh, subreddit, and sometimes it seems like the AI can is can f when it doesn't know what to do, it's almost trying to weirdly path their units inside the the fort. Like I've overclocked my CPU, I've added more RAM, I've got a good graphics card, so it shouldn't be doing this. I'm on a um, i7 4790K, which I've overclocked to 4.6 gig. Um, I'm on a GTX 1060 3 gig card. Like, and I'm on 16 gig of RAM, so it shouldn't happen, but it is. Cavalry's coming in. Let's put these guys up here. Because if this is where the reinforcement is going to come from, I may as well shoot at them as they go past. Also, let's pull these guys off of their section of the wall. Unit down. Okay, change fire onto 12 pounder foot artillery. Guys, going to continue their fire. Yeah, like now, I literally have no one in combat. No one is in hand-to-hand -hand fighting anywhere. Yet it's got frame ratey. So, according to some people in the subreddit, it's the AI's pathfinding and sieges can be just a bit screwy. So, I'm quite glad to have. Uh, seen it without there being any actual uh, combat. I mean, it's not just me going insane, it's something to do with the game. Okay, let's turn off, fire it well, turn it back on again, because only this war is firing. Okay, let, yeah, here come the Swiss Grenadiers. back to get more of them in the picture so that this unit can fire proper broadsides. See this this is all the combat I have. <laughs> it's all going screwy. Oh, militia starting to try climb the wall. So they are winning slightly, in which case I want to get... Not musketeers, grenadier guards. Let's get you in. And at the same time take this unit. Bring it down to the central square. I'll get another artillery unit. Or actually, let's just drop quick climb onto that little square. Should have put down some stakes, really, but live and learn.
Good, Swiss Grenadiers are wavering. Uh, quick time shells still going off, so I presume that's too close for me to target. them in combat. Don't follow the cavalry out the gate. Engage these grenadiers that are wavering. The artillery has missed the gendarmerie. Infantry run. Whoop, a very, very slow artillery barrage. It's going to be just too late to impact them, I think. Someone was knocking at my door. This kind of wall's going well. Bit. So these guys are going to be picked off, going to get picked off by all the guys I've got in the buildings. Wavering, a few more deaths would be great to make them rout. Good. Fall back. Go for that unit of cover in the back, actually. So let's see what this barrage manages to do. 86 cavalry, which shells get in. There they come in. The artillery isn't actually firing so may as well keep them firing at cavalry. Get this unit of inventory back on the walls because one of them is trying to scoop round. Good, let's have you fall back. my infantry losing to militia. Hmm, where might I want some grenadiers get involved? I should be able to fire now. Devastating volley. Don't even form square, I don't think. Go back. 
There we go, pathfinding is back again. From square and all my infantry here. Oh no. They managed to double bluff me. Dragoons are coming in on foot. Gendarmerie. My like thing was the report. Once the grenade guards got involved, that then that was the end of the gen. That was the end of this militia, militia assault. Preemptively form a bunch of my units into squares because I can see I can see this new unit of gendarmerie coming in through the rear. Let's get my general in. Let's flee my gunners back. Ultimately, should have deployed stakes, but I didn't. No gunners. Flee. Flee the scary men and their pointy sticks. general out before he dies to a silly okay let's run my gen run my run these guys up well no i was about to say run these up to uh, deploy stakes but to be honest it looks like most of the cavalry is actually well no it is coming back This breach seems to be a bit of a bust, so in fact... Oh, you go for them. Okay, one gun. Missed. Took out one unit of cavalry. Engineers, deploy stakes. Is the unit about to charge in? Oh, there you go. Almost halved it. That is a huge line of stakes. Let's fall back. See, this is the sort of thing that can screw games up. An artillery tries to retreat to leave the fort and it ends up opening the gates. Ok, 
Okay, let's use Quick Lime to pick at their rear forces. Here comes another reinforcing army. Devastating loss of cavalry there. To be honest, let's limber up this unit of artillery. Bring them up and fire into the advancing Prussian stacks. Let's go for the Grenadier Regiment coming in. I know they gain experience using round shot but holy moly. These guys are going to try climb the uh, climb the ruins of the breach, the shoulder of the breach. Go on, fire that cannon. Good, the gates aren't closed. Is have bugged, so let's do stand down, click fire at will. Hasn't really done much, so it's all down to these guys. Ooh, shrapnel shots come in and then absolutely annihilate that unit of foot line. Definitely kill those the uh, Republican Guard because once they get a foothold up here, we are screwed. So I'm even move these guys over. Yep, because my last remnants of infantry are starting to waver. Let's push the fusiliers. What are you? Superior line? No, you are grenadiers. Oh, these are horse grenadier guards are dismounted. Hit 
This unit of Prussian Jaegers. Good, 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 good. Mass retreats from the breach. Good. So the artillery is coming in. You're on quick climb shot, so be free rain. Let's go secure the gatehouse. I'm going to sneeze. Oof. The old sneeze. Good. There's the quick line coming in. Good, now open fire. Straight down. Oh, many of them fell from the ropes. Folks for this Union of Dragoons. Good, and they are getting slaughtered as they climb up the hill. Oh, lovely. Give that man a promotion. Bring them over to reinforce because I do not want them to capture this gate. How many men do I have? 70 plus 47. So we've got rough parity on numbers, but they are starting to get a foothold. But this is pretty much their entire strength. So when they get sandwiched... Oh, howitzers versus Dragoons. There you go, half of their strength gone in one volley. That's right, you waver against the might of the United States. Let's see how quickly they go down when they finally rout. How quickly they, uh, their numbers fall then. 61 wavering, 58 wavering. 55, oh god, lost 13 men, their resolve got stronger. Your troops, not bad. 
So 42 wavering. Shaken. Oh, they're getting better. I've got a bit of an advantage on the left flank. That's remembrance remnants of my Grenadier Guards are. Okay, so we don't hit danger close. Let's go for their general's unit. Routing. Kill them. Oh, this guy with his sword was flailing out. Got him though. Whew. Close run thing. One general's bodyguard coming in, so let's go back to firing out the guns. Or, to be honest, once the general's bodyguard's been shot to bits, go out there with my general. Oh dear, they're going to lose a few when they get shot out by these chaps. Get my unit of artillery. To, eh, keep them firing it out of the guns for now, it's not a worry. But speed up time. Now make them fire on the dragoons. So you are horse artillery, you are 24 pound of foot artillery, you are the primary target. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Go for the horse artillery unit, I suppose. Could chase down that unit of infantry, but if I can knock out more of their guns facing me in any follow up battles, that's probably a better idea. My infantry will annihilate their infantry. Oh, they're free. Close victory. Oof, that was a big battle, a lot bigger. My garrison is quite weak, so I need to spend lots of money reinforcing it. Hmm, 800 men. 800 very valuable men. Granted, they lost a lot more than I did, um, but still, they're men I can't re replace as easily. Naples got his ass handed to them. Hmm. Oh, good. They fell back from. They fell back from their uh, their Jerusalem city. It's good for me. I'm not sure about all those armies. All those armies clustering together on the uh, the Greek. The Greeks, though, not the Greekland. Bit of a concern. Persians, Persians gonna Persian. Ooh, will the Spaniards take Naples? Oh, Sweden lost against the Russians. They will lead siege to Finland. There is a port Do a bit of not yet been developed. Select Okay, firstly. Firstly and most importantly, 
replenish and recruit a unit of bog standard line. You need mass. Protestant missionary in Algiers. Good, you can stay there. Rake in Maine. You're probably going to stay there now. Fleet has arrived in this trade zone. Fortunately, no enemies abound. Not all friendly. I can't remember what your job was, but it's probably to ferry a fleet. I'll have to check back in a previous video. So let's put you in um, Cape Forshu in Nashwak. Go on, raising another army in Egypt. Good, you'll soon be ready. Sir. You're replenishing, you're replenishing. So grazing your military buildings. You may as well lay siege to Damascus. Or maybe even take Damascus, because that's not really a fight. So I'm going to demolish all these buildings and build up from scratch. And then probably recruit a unit of... like no, Just a regular unit of line infantry there in your place. Common roads, commercial basin. Mm, got some navy, naval forces in Cyprus. Um, but yeah, looking at the timer, I think that's the end of this part. So, Sir. thanks for watching, guys, in that marathon of a battle. Um, yeah, general plan is to keep putting pressure on the Sir. Prussians. Actually, first I'll annihilate them with this guy, Otto Herman. Excellent. Now replenish your troops. A bit closer to the action. Awesome. Radio guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.